turn on. I had to go turn it on. You are live on Wednesday hump day. Hump, hump, hump. Hump, you hump. All righty. Who all's here? Just you. Yep, just me. Okay. Oh, little baby. Oh. I could just hold you through the whole sale, and you could just be my baby, okay? Mama's baby. See, if I kiss on one of them, then they all come. And I'm like, I can't hold all. Some of you weigh a ton. So what channel is that on, Vexing? Whose channel is that? Um, well, it slipped my mind her name. Um, wait a minute, I'll tell you. When it comes back up on the screen. All right. I hope somebody shows up for this auction. Lydia. I am missing my nap. Lydia, L I D I A. Lydia. Uh, heard of a Lydia. And she goes by A R I T O Jules. Aristocat. Arito okay. Jules. Aristo. Okay. So it's A R I T O. Aristo. A-R-I-T-O. Right. Jules. Arito Jules. Right. Arito Jules. There she is. Live. Much. All right. Then next. I, I will... Uh, so it's Vicky that has all the sterling. Right. Lydia does sterling too, but right now she's letting Vicky sell since she's newer. Oh, is she I thought she was going out of business or something. She's just new. No. No, she she makes a lot of jewelry and stuff like that, but she's just selling, you know, to make some money. All right, who's out there? I see you looking. Lurker. I'm going to go get my coffee. If you're here, say hey. supposed to be. Do what she is doing and sit down and be good. Hello, Denise. I did send you an invoice, honey. You might want to check your email. It came from Square. Um, and it's probably going to say something about documents and crafts because it's my um, it's my Square invoice that I use for my paralegal business too. Well, it says we got five in here, so I guess we can get started. 
Anybody else here and you want to say hi, say hi, hi, hi. Hi, hi, hi. So this necklace will start, well, first of all, let me tell you all that we're going to do a giveaway. Halfway through, I'm going to do a giveaway to everyone. And then at the end, whoever purchases entries into the drawing for this big bucket of jewelry. All right, so this one is a no name, but it does have some glass beads on it that are very interesting. I've never really seen those before, and it has metal beads on it. And we're going to start this one at $2. Hey, Julie. Um, I'm glad you're not driving today. That makes me feel so much better. And I think they've got his infection on the lung cleared up, but not going to do an upper GI and a lower to find out why the heck he's throwing up constantly. And now his dad's throwing up and can't breathe. So I don't know if they both got food poison and pneumonia both or what's going on. We can't figure it out. But I'm hoping by the end of the day we have some kind of answers. So this is a uh, silver tone metal ball with some really pretty glass beads. Um, they have some kind of, um, I don't know what you call that, inside of there. It's almost like, it's almost like a foil or something. I don't know what it is inside those glass beads. It's really cute though. We're starting it at $2. Any interest? At least it got the infection cleared up in the lungs. Yes. And then I also have this one for $2. This is name brand Essence, made in the USA. And this has um, plastic beads and um, little different size beads. And then the big rock beads. And then the little name tag. These are both starting at $2. And then I have this beautiful AB bead beaded bracelet. Here is the clasp on it. Just like that. And it's got a little stretch to it. And that one's starting at $2. It's really pretty on. Don't eat my clothes, you guys. And then we have this cross necklace. It is really pretty. Got some beautiful, um, what do you call it, on it. And that one's starting at $2. And Piggy D is here. Hi, Miss Nikki. How are you doing, you little doll? Nice to see you. You want the bracelet for $2? You've got it, Miss Picking me. Thank you very much. And you'll get an entry into the drawing. Yay! Yippee, yippee, skippy. Anybody else interested in any of these other three for $2? I checked and I haven't received an invoice yet. Well, Denise, I'll... Um, it could have went in your junk pile because it actually, sometimes people recognize that it's from me. Let 
but um, I sent it to the email that you used to email me yesterday, not the PayPal email, but the email that you emailed through to me. You know what I mean? Does that make sense? We have a jewelry jar to give away at the end of the auction at four o'clock. And then at three o'clock, we'll do a, a, we'll play a game. This is the big old fat jewelry jug. Okay, Denise. So I got Picky's, Nikki's bracelet and I got her in the drawing. We got three necklaces out here for two dollars each if anybody's interested in those now this necklace is going to be three it's a little bit um got a little bit more to it it's got these little metal flowers and these adorable ab beads and i'll lay it out here so y'all can see it it's got loft oh, it's from the loft so we'll start this one at three it's really pretty. It's got pink flowers and orange flowers. And for some reason, they just, uh, and purple, they all just kind of flow together with the little AB beads around them. So that one's three. These here are two. I have a, um, Vintage um, Lucite necklace. This one is going to be 12. It is absolutely beautiful. Here's your clasp. Love that. <laughs> A big pile of rubber stamps. <laughs> I like stamps too. <laughs> okay, so this is a gorgeous, gorgeous brooch. It has pink rhinestones, AB rhinestones. Um, it's full of beautiful rhinestones, and it is going to be $10 starting bid. This is beautiful, beautiful. Now this necklace that I put up for starting at 12, this is a vintage, genuine Lucite necklace. Hence the $12. I actually had it for sale for $20 yesterday. And then we have a little guitar brooch. This one is going to start at 5 It really looks like a real guitar, too. And this is a very pretty necklace. It has little tiny pearls. And then each one of these are glass of different colors. And this one is going to start at four. So you got red, green, gold, blue, purple, pink, on and on and on. She knows what you're thinking about. Tiny pearls and colored glass. And then a 
this bracelet is really cool. I'm going to start one off at five. Look how cool this is. It's got all these different size of chains with some beautiful um, rhinestones in there too. But then after you put it on your arm, it just magnets shut and it's really strong. So that's cool. Love that. Bling, bling, bling. Nikki wants the guitar. All right, five on the guitar for Nikki. You got it. Put that in your bucket. These are costume rings and they are adjustable. They're new and these are going to be $2 each. This is an enamel brooch, gold tone and white in great condition. That's going to be $3. And mix it up with name brand things and non name brand things. I have a uh, rhinestone. Um, it's cut in, um, what do they call that cut? You'll know when you see it. This is a... Julie wants to see the peacock, please. Can I see what, I think it looks like a red peacock. Okay, sure. It's got all these A, B rhinestones around here. And then it's got rhinestones on the top of the head, a rhinestone in the eye, and then it's got these pink rhinestones down the uh, wings. These are just big red beads, rhinestones in here. There's your pin. There's the back. This one is 10. This is a Coro, C-O-R-O. -O. It is a Coro necklace with the Lucite. And this, I believe, has the bracelets that go with it. Yes, that's right. That one has the bracelets that goes with it. And let me find it real quick. That set is 25. If I could see, it'd be different. Is. The bracelet is so pretty too. Hi, Stronzo Vagapali. Hi. So this is Coro, which is a vintage um, high-end jewel costume jewelry. Maker, and we have a set here for twenty five. You're welcome, Julie. This 
if you want to make me an offer on it, Julie, I'll, I'll gladly, gladly. Um, allow that or whatever you want to call it. I don't know. Accept the fact that you're making an offer. This one here is also a coral. It has rhinestones in it, but it has baguettes. The entire thing is just baguettes everywhere. There's a good look at it. And this one is 18. This is a silver tone, uh, $3. It has this rhinestone heart, and then it's inside of a ring. And that one's going to be $3. Up here where you see it. Did you say two or three? Three. really cute it's subtle um it's a tone chain with these really pretty little subtle blue enamel beads or what do you want to, discs it's longer and we will start that one at three am i confusing everybody by leaving it all out there should i be pulling it up vexing Huh? Yes, ma'am. Okay. <laughs> okay, okay. So right now we're looking at this one for three. It's long. It's in new condition. I love those enamel, little enamel dots. Any interest? There's a lot on your plate. <laughs> oh my God, you guys are so funny. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh my gosh. So you guys don't realize later later on, later in the day, I'll think about something y'all said and I start laughing. My husband's like, What are you laughing about? Oh, just vexing. <laughs> she She'll, she'll do something or say something that just makes me laugh and, and I'll tell him what it is and he's just like, he don't get it. <laughs> okay, that's all right. Um, 
I will. If you, <laughs> I don't know how to do this. Um, if you will send me the email that is not your PayPal email, um, then I'll just redo your invoice and resend it. No biggie. I will. Okay, so there's no interest in this one. We'll pull it aside. This one has a little uh, jewelry tag on it, and it says uh, Genuine Ivory. So this one, we will start this one at $6. It's new. Here it is up close. Just a little something different. Uh, and this one is labeled SHB. S is in Sam, H is in horse, and B as in boy. SHB is the name on here. I did not look it up. But this one is going to start at $3. It is a little red rhinestone necklace for all I know it could be real jewels because I did not check this one. Hey Judith, welcome in. Welcome to our nightmare. This is Genuine Ivory and this is SHB Jeweler and it they're both starting well, they're both starting at three. He'll be all right, boy. Who's Dubbins? Who's Dubbins? Is there a Dubbins in here? It's a nickname for somebody. Oh. Oh, I don't know, Judith. It just says Genuine Ivory. There. Oh, you're Dubbins. All right. That's, that's good. That's good. These are some really neat pierced earrings. They're gold toned, but they have like, I don't know, it's like an antique finish to them. Really cool. And we'll start those at $3. Nice set of earrings. Nuns and Dubbins. Oh, okay. I get it. I get it now. I think. <laughs> Do I? <laughs>
Anybody interested in any of these necklaces starting at three or the earring starting at three? Vexing, you gotta tell me when to pass. How come you send me a box? I could be, I could be lovin's. I can be part of your gang. You can give me a name. All right, we're passing on these. These are some cool, cool things here I got today. We got these uh, pierced earrings. I guess you could put a wire on them too if you wanted to wire them. But they have a big fat pearl and then some beautiful colored stone in there. Uh, don't see a label on them. So we'll start those at $3. Aren't they pretty? <laughs> Julie, 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 Julie. Julie, Julie. All right, Picky Nikki sold those to you for $3. Thank you very much. All right, next up, I have a brooch. This sucker is full of rhinestones. I mean, full. Look at all of them. <laughs> and we'll start that one at three. Being generous today, or cheap, or whatever you want to call it. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful brooch. Can't say enough beautifuls about this brooch. It's just this, I guess it's the silver tone along with the, um, the rhinestones is what makes it so, it just feels so cool. It's embarrassing. We don't have pet names for for us. Just I call him lots of different things, but it not really any of it's too sweet. Mostly Dicky. If there's no interest in that, let's move it out. Look at this. This is so different. It reminds me of Madonna. It's a great big O um, brooch. And we're going to start that one off at $3. Why not? Why not? Check. Let's see. Julie's asking a question. Oh, God. Uh, this one, um, since the year 2000, so almost 21 years. My first husband was like two years. I don't remember. My second husband was 14 years. My third husband was two years. And this one's 21. So I guess we're staying together. Oh, I just, I just every now and then I'll say, I'm calling that. But anyway. He answers to 
anything because he knows I'm just kidding. He knows I'm crazy and he likes it, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, this one's a real deal. Okay, we're going to pass the Donna's boob. We're going to go with this necklace. Now, this is a uh, patina. It's kind of, I don't know, kind of looks... Mm. I, can't, I can't even think of the words I'm trying to use. Yep. Okay, so this one is starting at $3. It is a patina necklace. This is one that I upcycled and painted with jewelry paint and sealed it. It is beautiful. Indian style, yeah. are a clip-on vintage pair of earrings here is your back here is your front they're a good size these are starting at three dollars vintage loveliness love me some vintage jewelry Yeah, I don't, I don't really need a man. Lord, please control what I say today, please. We're talking about men. You know I need control. Warts. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, I have another pair of vintage earrings. These are, I'm the one to come to if you want vintage jewelry. I can tell you that. It's about $1,000 worth of vintage jewelry from a lady's estate. And I think it was her and her sister's all. So these are vintage earrings. These are starting at $3. These are clip. And they are a big old fat pearl. Those are starting at $3. Yeah, and I don't even need that. It's overrated. We should do a choice up on some of these vintage earrings. Whoops. Can't see where that one went. I wish these dogs could second answer a question. Did you guys see where that earring went off to? 
Well, they'll have it eaten in no time. Yeah, I love my do. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All right, so look at these. Look at these vintage babies. Looks like they have some kind of mark on them. Let me see what that is. Oh, it's like Germany. She had a lot of Germany stuff. Germany, Hong Kong. Yeah, it's just something Germany. But look how cute these are. So we'll do choice of, nobody's interested in those. We'll do choice of this pair. And it was going to be one that I dropped. These are a vintage pierced. They have uh, their glass. Those cool. So these are going to be choice of starting at three dollars. See what else I got here. Oh Lord! Oh Lord! Some of these are so old. <laughs> it's not even funny, and they're marked too. They're all marked. That's what I love about them. She had tonnage, tonnage, tonnage. Oh, I love these. I really hate to say it, but I'm going to put these in there too. It's going to be choice of, look at those pink Lucite Vintage. So this is going to be choice of for $3. Our starting bid is $3. Yeah, anything that takes too much effort is what I'm against because my effort has been used up over the years. Any interest in any of these three? We got Julie at three. We got Picky at three. Nikki at three. Nikki, do you want to come in at four? You guys, I'm bringing you the best of the best on some of these earrings. These are true vintage beauties. This lady had everything. And I can't express that enough. That I wish I could keep every freaking one of these. Julie's at three. Okay, Julie, which pair do you like for three, honey? Nikki, you're so sweet. You're so nice. You're such a nice girl. I bet your mommy taught you very, very well. I need to have a talk with her and congratulate her for the great job she did. Pink, please. I knew it. You took my Lucite earrings. I'm going to bean you. Oh. Oh, I'm glad they're going to a happy home. All right. So that's Julie. And Picky Nikki. It is your turn to choose. You'll take the blue. Aren't they awesome? Yes, she is a doll. She really is a doll. Anybody interested in these little flying saucer ones? Look, they're trimmed in like this filigree gold tone. They're marked Germany. 
you could probably get $15 out of that pair if you resold them. Any interest? Oh, honey, I'm just teasing with you. I'm just acting like an addict here or something. I just know what I love. And when I love it, I love it. But I'm also strong enough to deal with it. I realize I'm 62 years old. And if it were a different pair of earrings I have here every day, I would not wear them all before death. Okay, so is anybody interested in these Germany ones? Last call. I'm telling you, these are worth about $15. Look at the vintage and March Germany. We are not all jewelry addicts, I know. Hi, Callie. Kelly, you want these for $3? They are made in Germany. They are vintage clip earrings. Look how well made these are. All right, Angie. Shut it on down. All right, so this next pair is Coro. These are genuine coral um, moon glass earrings. And these would be $10. Buy it now. You can see the uh, rhinestones across there. And then the green moonstone stone. <laughs> yeah, I can quit anytime I want to. They're be beautiful. Absolutely beautiful moon glass with rhinestones marked coral in excellent condition beautiful 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 well let's put it this way judith when i sell that thousand dollars worth of vintage jewelry that i bought i'll be looking for some more don't think I'm not on the lookout now. <laughs> you get weighted down. Well, I'm talking about from a reseller's aspect. These right here, you could get five times that for them. I need to just list and shut up. Okay, any interest in the, the Coro? Pearls. <laughs> It was the pears. <laughs> oh, what's the deal with the pears? <laughs> All right, so let's move those out. Oh, God. Cracking up laughing here. How about a beautiful wow. hush? We don't need any, any remarks from your section over there. This is a black seed bead necklace. And we'll start this one off at five. It's gorgeous. Just gorgeous. <laughs> oh, God, that was funny. Yeah, I got my coffee. I know the feeling. Any interest in the beautiful... Look how the clasp has these big seed bead balls on it. I just love those big balls. Her
Hurry back, Judith. No, I, I don't. I have these kind of balls. <laughs> All right. So next up is a purple rhinestone butterfly um, brooch. This one, <laughs> this one's going to be starting at five. Look how pretty. It's heavy too. What looks like little pearls, these, these are vintage. They are clip vintage. Aren't they cute? $3 and they, they could be yours. I don't know if they're or not. I don't have a pearl, a way of checking pearls. Taiwanese. <laughs> oh my God, you guys are so funny. That needs to be fixed. Any interest? In the purple rhinestone butterfly. It's so pretty. I love it. That thing tells me to pass. All right, we're going to pass on the butterfly. Why don't we just pass on everything? This is a, what do you call the, that, I forgot what it's called now. Anyway, uh, it's roach. A good size brooch too and we'll start this one off at four it's got like a turquoise background <laughs> yeah I do I love wearing clip-ons oh I have a lot of vintage stuff. I already said that, didn't I? Yeah, it's like a cloisonne. That's what it is. I had a bunch of ornaments, Christmas tree ornaments that were cloisonne that I sold. <laughs> I didn't know what they were worth. I had no idea. I thought they were ugly as hell. Any interest? Pass. Okay. This is a brooch pin. It says nurse, number one nurse on it. It's just, it's like a nurse's brooch, you know, that she would wear to celebrate the fact that she's a nurse. And we'll start this one at three. Yeah, I hear you, Judith. Mine's going to need warmed up. I would not be here right now for the power of coffee.
and a protein shake. Any interest? Let me hold it up here. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, definitely. If I don't drink them, then I feel sluggish. But um, and that's because of the type of surgery that I had, uh, you know, that I don't absorb fats or anything. So I got to make sure I get plenty of protein. <sighs> Love them. heck am I doing okay next I have a necklace that has how light it's long has a gold tassel and then it's super duper long I don't think of a name on it we're gonna start this one off at three it's a really pretty chain too Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, um, it's called a duodenal switch. It's like a gastric bypass, only you never absorb much fats. So therefore you're not absorbing vitamins either. So you have to make sure you take vitamins every day, lots of them, and keep your protein level up at least 60 grams a day and you're fine. I lost 100 pounds. But I wouldn't have ever gained 100 pounds if I hadn't quit smoking. As soon as I quit smoking, I gained weight. Never been fat in my life. Well, fats is not the only thing I don't absorb. I don't absorb the good stuff either, the vitamins and all. Yeah, it's it's a big deal. It's a major surgery. Forty thousand dollar surgery. Anybody interested in this cute little Howlite necklace? Three dollars. Pass. The woman said pass. This is a brooch. It has um, some stones in it. I don't know what they are or if they're even real. I just know that it's very unique, very different. And we'll start this one off at three. It's got a dark stone in the middle and these look like um, maroon color stones. also have this brooch it's got like a 
amber color glass to it and then it's got like an amber stone in the middle it's I guess it's not a brooch I guess it's something to put on a necklace or you can do whatever you want with it put a brooch on it so that one's three dollars and that's three dollars And then this one is a vintage one. It's um, silver tone. And it's got a lot of rhinestones on it. So all three of these are three bucks. We got Callie Unknown at $3. Callie, which one would you like, honey? All right, gotcha. Thank you, Callie. Anyone else? Here we go. So I have to tell you what sizes these are, but these are all 925 stone rings. Oh, where'd that come from? Hmm. And I have eight of them. They are all going to be $10. Buy it now. And um, I'll tell you the sizes. As soon as I find, there it is. Oh, that's a good idea. Yeah, that'd be cute. So this one that's pink is a 10. The pink is a 10. And it's the only pink. And then this one that has the sparkle in it is kind of looks like a. I'm going to say this is an eight and three quarters. And that's, there's another one that's like it, but it's just made a little different. And it's an eight. Oops. So eight and three quarters and eight. And then we have a green stone. It is a seven. Another green one. And it's a five and a half. And the red is a six and a half. And the black is a eight and a half. I guess it's black. And this one is a eight. The white is an eight. Yeah. The greens are a little 
different in shade. There's your red. There's your dark. They're all marked 925. There's your whatever you call that stone. I'm not sure what you called it. Couldn't remember if I tried. That's my favorite right there. The red, yes, you can. This is this I believe is a halite. Halite. It's it's got some lines running through it. You can see them there. Kind of has a glare. There we go. And then it has little prongs that come up on it. Six and a half. Wow, that's little, but that's what size I wear. Fixing, do you need one? No, I'm good, thank you. You're welcome. Thought you might need one to wear to the doctor. <laughs> oh, God, I'm crazy. You're welcome, Miss Julie. Julie Woolley. They're beautiful rings. And they're new, too. They're not used. Oh, and the middle finger? Yeah, I can't even get that over my knuckle. I must have big knuckles. Because it fits on my other finger. It's perfect. It's time for a giveaway. We need to get numbers put in here now. We need numbers between 1 and 20. Julie put it in there twice. <laughs> you want to make sure you saw it. <laughs> saw that baby. Get those numbers in. Let's see those numbers. Did it again after the start. Oh. Blingy bling bling bling. Hurry, hurry, hurry.
the pink and sparkle rings, please? You mean those brown sparkle ones? Yeah. Let me just verify that with you. Pink. These. One. Two. Three. If that's correct, you can. And I'll put them in your box right now. Your jug. Let me know if that's for sure. That's a big deal. Thank you so much. Stop. Hey, Siri. You need a number between 1 and 20. A random number between 1 and 20 is 19. 19. 19. Wow, where is Sharon today? Looks like it's Julie, doesn't it? Yeah. Looks like it's Julie. Congratulations, Julie. This is your what you win. You can use in today's auction. Stay. Stay. I got the fan on. Okay. Congratulations, my love. I'll put that in the jar. Julie, 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 Julie. Okay, things that sparkle. I got another brooch that sparkles. It's got some amber color rhinestones and a pink one right in the middle. And it's so cute. Let's do $3 on this little puppy. $3 is the starting bid. <laughs> I hope putting the number in there twice was the key. <laughs> Oh God, I got people wanting stuff. Okay, they saw the picture that I did with the vintage earrings and they're wanting some of them. Okay, so here we go. Is anybody interested in this brooch at only $3? Whoops. It is blingy bling. <laughs> that was funny, vexing. All right, I have a couple more rings I just found that I didn't show you guys. This one is a red halite. You can really see the halite in that one. And then this one is a square. Let me tell you the size. These are going to also be $10. Let me tell you the size. This one with the red halite is an 8. And the other one is an 8 and a half. I will send her jewels in the future when I win a piece 
and take the free shipping for now. A while ago, when she won, she said for you to give it to Sharon. She thought it was a jewelry jar. And when it turned out to be the $5 off, she wanted to keep it. So it'll be $5 off the purchase that she makes. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, I put that in her jar. So I remember to take $5 off. I, I, I was totally lost. <laughs> Thank you, baby. I was like, what? <laughs> Literally, like, am I losing it? All right, so if there's no interest in those, I do have a vintage um, brooch here that has some AB crystals on it. And here's what it looks like. And that one's also going to be $3. I don't know why I'm a $3 kick today, but. And this one is even older than that one. And it's got all of its rhinestones. Beautiful. So both of those will be $3 choice up. <laughs> Vexen gets it, boy. I'm telling you, she gets it. She's been watching these things for so many, for so long that she knows exactly what everybody means. I just things just go right over my head. Not all the time, most of the time. <laughs> I felt a lot of coral yesterday. So if anybody's interested in any of that, they need to go look at yesterday's. She is on the balls <laughs> uh, video. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, so I don't see any interest in those either. So these are uh, little rhinestone wooden vintage earrings, and we're going to start these at $3. Really pretty. I actually made these, upcycled these. I like them. They're boho. I found another pink one. Wow, what size is this one? This one is a nine. So yeah, if anybody's interested, I did find another pink one. It's a nine. I could just wear that one. Yeah. All righty. Past. These are screw back earrings. They have a name on them. I think it's. Sure, let me look. I was thinking it was Japan. Yeah, it's Japan. So these are Japan screwbacks. The color is like a grayish green. There's your back. There's your front. Just some cute little balls that hang everywhere. We'll, we'll start these off at three. Really cute. Made in Japan. Vintage. Screw back. Oh, 
Uh, no, there's a way you can dress boho no matter how old you are and still look adorable. It's a fine art. <laughs> oh, Lord, you guys crack me up. This is a brooch. It's purple um, with gold tone around the outside of it. It's really pretty. Just very simple. And we'll do three on that too. If you guys are interested in um, just all around everything stuff, I am going to have an everything stuff sale tomorrow sometime around four. Watch for it. I'm going to have a look at everything. Not, not, no jewelry, just household things, vintage, uh, curtains, mm, kids stuff toys uh, no clothing no shoes or anything like that it's just going to be um, you know everything but jewelry clothing and shoes ah <laughs> yeah i hear you okay so we're going to pass on these Good one, Judith. Good one. These are Lucite vintage clip-ons. They're in excellent condition. They are blue and white, or light blue and dark blue. Just cute as a button. Those are going to be five. Starting bid is five. They are real Lucite. So real thing. The real thing. I don't know anything about depends. If I ever needed depends, I'll probably just wear Kotex. Can you show the purple brush again? Huh? Can you show the purple brooch again? Um, purple, purple bro oh yeah, that, that little purple brooch. It looks like a jelly belly. Yeah, I guess you have to take those to pins and you can Mm. Put make a make a cover for them that's got flowers on it or something. I don't know. I'm not wearing the things, that's for sure. I am not wearing no depends. I'll wear a Kotex pad before I'll wear a Depends. I'll piss my pants, which I already do anyway, so what's the difference? <laughs> Monday through Sunday. <laughs> you remember having them underwear? Yes, I had them. I loved them. I loved them. Anybody interested in the beautiful Lucite earrings for five? These are clips. I'll bring out some uh, pierced. I'm just so happy about my vintage earrings. These are also five. They're clips. They're also a clip earring. 
they're really cool. You talk about boho. Here we go. These are boho. Any interest? have a half hour left yep back in the Jurassic period <laughs> the Jurassic period that craps me cracks craps me up I believe you. Okay, so is there any interest in either one of these pairs at five? These are little owl earrings with blue sapphire eyes. And we will do four on those. I hold them up here better. I don't know why there's a glare. And these are pierced. These are like from the 1950s. Big chunks. They're pierced though. And these are going to be three. I love them myself. So I'm going to lay earrings out here. They're all going to be three choice of. These have some kind of stones in, in them. Reminds me of a Cheerio. So it's going to be choice of on these pierced pairs for $3. You see ones you want hollow. <laughs> oh, that's funny. These are kitty cats. Nice little thick ring. Yeah, I gotta have the peanut. I don't want the slimy peanut butter with no nuts in it. These are made in Hong Kong. They have that moon glow to them. You see a pair you want, holler. These are all going to be pierced. And 
they're all going to be three. You're still thinking about the peacock? I tell you to make me an offer and it can be yours. These are neat. They have a lot of jingles on them. Yeah, I gotta have chunky. They have hearts, per pearls, um, baby beads, metal, a bunch of cute little things on there. These are really cute too. They're really, they remind me of a little hat. Vintage, the vintage look. Those are more of an orange. Tell you the truth. I found that sterling silver hair that I couldn't find that one night. That one night so long ago. Okay, so these are pierced earrings. Look at those, aren't they cool? Oops, there's the back. These have a green stone on them. A little stone. God, there's so many people out there with that organic kick going. These are a little um, kind of midwest, or what do you call it? Western style, Western style. Midwestern. these yeah I don't like it these are a big purple faceted jewel there's your back it's star tone those are really 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 cute These are pink. Um, Julie has a question. Are the circles and beads heavy? Circles and beads. These? Laying right next to the purple ones. No, they're not. They're not heavy at all. They're very light. 
If you want heavy, those are not the ones you want. These are baguettes, pink baguettes. These are new, brand new, and they are cute as can be. Look at those pretty baguettes. Right. Callie said she would like those earrings, please. All righty, I got it for you. Thank you. Never seen a clip like that. It goes over there. I also like to talk to myself. It's kind of fun. Thank you, Callie. I know somebody's got to want these. If not, you're crazy. These are uh, pierced metal painted metal i guess and then they have a little pearl in the middle and that would be cute on the ear I'm going to have to do a thorough investigation of the floor when I'm done. These are kind of, they kind of give me that mid-century vibe. Oh yeah, I always answer my own questions. I call myself by name. Really weird, I'm telling you. Okay, now this is a brand new, this is a set for those that need a set. It has your little rhinestones and then it has your little rings. And they're also $3. I love being alone. Honestly, I do not need people at all. These are really cute. Uh, somebody's going to get a good deal on these if they choose. Those cute. I like these mid century vibe too. Those are pretty. Gorgeous. Denise, are you still here, honey? I haven't heard from you. You're not joining in our craziness? I believe she left. I don't even talk to my friends in the real world anymore. Just the people on YouTube, I can see. <laughs> You'll see me tomorrow because I won't, I will be behind the camera tomorrow. These are sterling silver. I'm going to ask, I think I'm going to ask $10 for this pair. They also have a real stone on them. I think they're gorgeous. So that's the only pair there that's not $3. I think that's Unikite stone. What? 
Unikite, is it like pink and green? Yes, it is. Right, that's Unikite. Yep. And the red's probably red jasper. I just think they're beautiful. Have you ever seen another human being again? <laughs> I am rolling on the floor laughing my ass off. <laughs> That's exactly the way I feel, Julie. God, I don't know what these are, but they, oh shit, one on the floor. These are really neat. I don't even know where I got these, to tell you the truth. <laughs> Look how cool those are. Oh, I've never seen any like them. There's the back of them. They kind of like a, a Mexican tile floor or something. <laughs> yes, you wear it when you're alone. Who cares what other people think? You only have to please yourself. These are pierced also. I, I don't think they have a name on the back of them, but they're beautiful. You can just, uh, you don't need clothes. <clears throat> you need jewelry. These have the cutest little halite beads and pearls. Yes, you can. Allie wants to see them. Oops, sorry. Yeah. Can you get a good look at it from my hand? They're different. They're very different. I don't know what they are. I don't even know where I got them. I just think they're awesome. Awesome sauce. Callie, you want those? All right, honey. They're yours. They are neat. If they turn out to be like real valuable, then just get my ass. No, it's okay. It's all right. I can deal with it. Who needs money? Sold to you, Callie. These are those, um, those ones I was talking about earlier that have that. I can never think of names of things when I need it. Anyway, you know, you guys get the idea. Enamel or poison eye? Poison eye, yeah. Those are for sure poison eye. For, for, for sure, for sure, for sure. Well, that's cool because I can't spell poison eye. C L O I S O N E. These are Chico's. These are absolutely adorable. I hope I have the other one. <laughs> yes. Okay, so look at these, you guys. Look how cute. Aren't they cute? These are Mark Chico's. That ball is an A B crystal bead and then you've got this beautiful looks like enamel over metal copper or something and then Mark Chico's on the back. You got question. 
how much and Callie needs to be smurfed. What's that mean? Callie, are you still subscribed to me? You better check and see. Turn blue. Which ones is it she's asking about? Which ones are you wanting to know? I don't know. They're all three dollars except the sterling silver pair. This this pair here is ten. Otherwise, they're all three. Yeah, they're all three dollars. Can't even think. Let alone talk. I have some really cute earrings here. I didn't even know I had. Yeah, um, there was a girl that came in here and bought a bunch of stuff, and then she never paid for it. She said she didn't realize that she was getting it up that high or something. I was like, what? I, don't, I, don't, I just don't understand people. Just don't get it. Don't get it at all. That's okay. Vex, I do. When grandkids come over, they can sleep in guest room because of boxes, attic, and basement are full too, as well as my storage unit. My husband is going to leave or have me committed. Well, I don't think, I think it really would hurt my feelings too much. As long as he paid the bills, he could go. Leave. They don't let the door hit you. You know? These are cute, too. These are like a little sweet, dainty rhinestone. Oh, those are cute. Yeah. Okay, so we've got ten minutes left. Let me put these away. After my company goes home, I'm going to go through all this jewelry and figure out what I've got better because it has so much of it coming in at one time that I really did not take the time I needed to. On it. A bunch of coral earrings in Japan and Germany. Stuff that I know is well worth more than three dollars. So I just get up there and list it. Vexing, you want the rhinestone dangles? Was there anything else you wanted? The ones that kind of look like cowboy hats, the orange ones. The cowboy hats? Mm hmm Okay. And then the turquoise colored ones on the card. Yes, okay. Where is your jar? Thank you so much. Well, I thank you so much more than you thank me so much. Let's see. Oops. Oops, oops, oops. Oh, and one more pair. The ones that have the hearts on them with the dangles. Kind of gold colored off to the left. These? Yeah. These are clip, you know. That's fine. Okay. You got it. Those are yours. These go 
Oh, yeah, I got a bracelet here. This is so cute. Let's do $3 on this bracelet. Get the heck out of my way. Look how cute. Starting $3. I don't know if it's marked or not. No, I don't see anything. It's got all kinds of little cute beads on it. Worked my entire life and have enough to take care of myself. If he gets pissed, what can you do? I feel bad that he thinks I'm a hoarder of beautiful things and that there is something wrong with me. There's nothing wrong with you. As long as you keep things organized and you know where they are, that's all that matters. And that's what I did this year. The whole first six months of this year was getting all of my crap organized. Now I feel better about it. And I, I released a lot of stress by doing that. I feel much better about it. I also have this wooden bead necklace for $3. I personally love wooden beads, but not everybody does. I have this one too. It's got some really neat wood beads on it. They would actually look cute worn together. Anyone interested in the bracelet with charm? How cute. I think we lost um, a couple of people somewhere along the line. I must have got boring. There's Sharon. Hey, turkey. Turkey bird. Turk bird, turk bird, turk bird. Yeah, Julie, you could get on here and sell with me. This is a cute little pink necklace. It's free to the first person that types in me. It's cute. Oh, you're shopping. Oh, what'd you buy me? Yeah, we missed you. And Picky Nikki was here, but I don't think she's still here. And then we had Denise in here, and I don't think she's still here. There must have been another auction come on, or maybe I got too boring. I don't know. Yeah. Free to the first person to type me. Me, 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 me. My dogs are looking at me like, what in the hell is she doing now? What do we got going? All right, Callie, it's yours. Look at this. This is really cute. It's a new condition, too. That one will be four. Yeah, you don't have to be on camera. Just put the stuff on camera. Uh, Four dollars on this necklace. I don't know who made it, but it's a well-made one.
Yeah, we don't even know your name, Callie. You are secret. Okay. Well, this one here is um, acrylic beads, black and brown mixed together. Kind of cool. And it's free to the first person that says me. Yeah, do you sell, Callie? Just buy, buy, buy. Don't worry, guys. We're going to take nap in a little bit. And then Daddy's going to come home and put some pork chops on the grill. And I'm going to clean the hall bathroom for company. I'm thrilled. <laughs> they don't want it. you did which ones you're the only one that likes my stuff yeah the pork chops too on the grill Sharon said me Sharon said me okay Sharon it's going in your box Thank you. All right. So that goes in there. All right. I've got everything ready for this drawing. Oops, I just dropped one. Drawing time. Which ones did you wear? I know, but not everybody does. Okay, so everybody that purchased, each time you made a purchase, you got in this drawing. And it's for a big old jug of jewelry. Ready? Go. And you have to be present to win. Nikki, Nikki, are you here? Picky Nikki, are you here? I'm going to start doing that throughout all my jewelry auctions. Just every now and then out of the blue, I'm going to throw something out there and say it's for the first person that says me. And see if I can keep people's attention better. Picky Nikki, are you here? 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 
five, four, <laughs> three, two, one, buzz. Okay, we gotta draw again, guys. The metal round, blue and gold. Oh, I love those. The disc. Yes, I love those. Patina. Looks like we got another picky Nikki. Well, she did buy quite a bit today at first until she left. <laughs> Do it again. Kelly. All right. I know you're here. Kelly is the winner, the winner of the big jar of jewelry. It's got some good stuff in there. Yeah, baby. Yeah. Yeah, baby. Winner is Kelly. Now write that down. You're not the winner, Oliver. Kelly is. Kelly jewelry jar. And I'm going to put a tag in there with your name on it. That way I for sure do not get it wrong. Congratulations and enjoy. So tomorrow around 4, I'm going to be doing a auction from my basement where I'm going to be auctioning off a little bit of this and a little bit of that. There just won't be any jewelry. There won't be any clothing and there won't be any shoes. So that leaves a lot of other stuff. Puzzles, games, toys, household stuff, um, dishes, vintage, a lot of cool, cool stuff. And it be at 4 Eastern Standard Time. And, um, let's see, anything else you need to know? Um, I did send invoices out. Please check your emails. They're, remember, they're not PayPal. They have come from my document and crafts from Square. And, and I'm a paralegal, so if you know anybody that needs any legal documents let me know spread the word and looks like husband is home for work it's time for mama to go lay down and rest you haven't missed an auction no you have not sharon <laughs> all right oh good denise good 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 i'm so glad you found it sweetheart Yes, everyone have a wonderful rest of the day, and we'll we'll meet back here tomorrow at 4. Thank you all, and love you, and bye-bye.